I'm with Alan White, obviously our central defender. Alan, what's obviously pre-season been like for you? I know you've been suffering from the injury. You know, how's it going and how are you feeling now? Yeah, well, it's, it's probably been my worst pre-season since I was about 17, 16, because I've, I injured myself playing in a charity seven-a-side competition just before we went back for the first day's training. Ankle was like an elephant. So I missed all the pre-season training, missed the first two matches. Um, then when I did play a game in Sunderland, I did it again. So it's swollen up again, but we'll just have to see how it goes. But um, it's been OK. The lads have done well, and that's the main thing. So I think the team's prepared. And obviously, as one of our season pros, you know, how important is a good pre-season for the players? It's essential, yeah. It's, 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 it gives a player confidence as going into the start of the season. Because obviously, all the other teams are a bit of an unknown quantity. There's people changing hands and going to different clubs. So you've got to be best prepared you can. So you can only affect what you do. So if the players are confident and they're ready and 100% prepared, then you've got the best opportunity to win on Saturday because you can't really, you can't really worry too much about the opposition because they're an unknown quantity. How impressive have you been with the sort of the quality of the pre-season opponents that we faced so far? It's been good. Um, I mean, we've played a lot of um, you know academy teams, young lads, obviously at um, Sheffield Wednesday and uh, Blackburn and uh, Sunderland the other night. And it's a different kind of football than what we were playing this year in, the, in, in our league. The movement and the pace of the game is frightening, but it's been great. And it's, a good, it's great for fitness for the lads. Um, and then obviously we've had a couple of games. We had the game against Harrogate on, on Saturday. It's a little bit more what we're expecting to, to, to get in a league game. And the lads sort of more than coped and cruised it, really. So it's, it's, it's been great. But the, the test from the, like the, 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 the sort of higher league teams has been fantastic. Just what we need. Now, we've got obviously quite a few new teams in the division this season. Which teams... Uh, specifically, are you looking forward to playing them? Which ones do you think are going to be the harder ones in the leagues? Well, I think you're, you've got to look at sort of Telford and Stockport and pe- t- uh, teams like that. Is it South End and Down? Uh, sorry, Southport. Do they know a league now? Southport, they get relegated or they stay up? I As I say, it's <laughs> difficult, but I mean, obviously, you're looking at they'll be the same teams as last year. Altrincham will be thereabouts and Guys will be thereabouts. And, um, say Oxford will play on Saturday. They're, they're fancied as well. Gainsborough. They're all going to be good, but I say it's an unknown. It's an unknown thing because you don't know who's come in, who's left. You don't know whether they've had a good pre-season. Um, but I fancy us, to be honest. I fancy us this year. So anyone that we we come across, I'm, I'm confident we can do the job. That's great. Thanks so much. Sam.